Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming to check out the stream. Thank you for coming to check out the video. Cornflakers here from CPG, going to be broadcasting this match live from the StarCraft II Algoma University Games, Activities, Media, and Entertainment Club. I do believe this is game 44 between Seedzy and L. L. We will just call her L again for this match. L, last game playing Zergling, getting stomped by Seedzy, who was playing Protoss at the time. Both teams. Just sending their drones onto the mineral line. Uh, just trying to get that early CS. Seeds are currently uh, supply blocked at the moment. L just spending the last minerals on the drone there. As soon as it pops, it will be supply capped. Oh, and Seeds are doing the, uh, the Fantasy. Losing 19 minerals. However, he is getting the uh, he is getting that extra supply. We are finally back online. Uh, internet cacked out for a moment. Nothing to worry about. Uh, so once again, Cornflakers here from CPG Gaming, a new Northern Ontario-based pro gaming group. Um, mainly doing the shoutcasting here today for you guys of the StarCraft II tournament match. Game number 44 from Algoma University in Sault Ste. Marie, Ontario, Canada, on planet Earth, if you're watching this from somewhere else. How's it going? Um, so, uh, these two, these two team, uh, these two opponents currently going against each other. Uh, we have a Z versus Z because we are up in Canada, so it's Z not Z. Um, these two opponents, I do believe, are boyfriend and girlfriend. Uh, so do let us know the battle of the sexes. Which one do you think is going to win? And which one do you think is which? Is CZ the girl? Or is L the guy? Who will know? You guys decide. Leave it in the comments. Rate, comment, subscribe. Follow us here on YouTube for your opportunity to get the latest updates on this StarCraft tournament. And now with me talking, I have missed this extremely fast expansion by both teams, getting that hatchery down. Um, 200 minerals, approximately 15 supply, 15 supply for L, and 15, 17 supply for CZ. Uh, let's take a quick look at the resources here. CZ currently sitting on 200, around 300 minerals. Um, income, pretty much even. Is a lot more even than last game. Um, both teams, uh, both both players, building the uh, the extractor there, and getting one up as well, and a spawning pool, uh, spawning pool going up as well by both teams. Both teams are evenly matched. This game is being pretty much played by the exact same player, flipped over a mirror line, ladies and gentlemen. This is uh, this is just crazy. Uh, if we take a look at the units being built, we have three overlords, three overlords, seventeen drones, seventeen drones. However. Two larva, wonder what they're going to become. Who knows? Loud, crunchy items being chewed upon behind me. And, uh, oh, I <laughs> got some chocolate covered uh, almonds for rock got and roll. Some rock and roll. Got my big bag of nuts that I've currently yet to bust into. And, uh, <laughs> that sounds completely wrong. Ladies and gentlemen, I do assure you I have a giant bag of nuts. Um, and, uh, so yeah, we got this overlord. We got this overlord coming down here. Finally going to be getting some sight on um, both overlords in both players' bases. CZ scouting out the area, and uh, not a whole lot going on other than that, that really fast early expansion. Going to be getting some zerglings from this base, going to send them back home. I uh, wonder if CZ is doing the same thing. Has he been building zerglings yet? No, he has not. Uh, we have six zerglings already, one queen. Uh, L definitely getting the jump on CZ here. We have that one queen up by CZ. But is it going to be enough? CZ taking down that Overlord. Will he be able to get it? If so, that will effectively supply block L. Hopefully we can get it there. 77, 69. Ladies and gentlemen, 60, 51. And I will be counting this down for you. Hopefully he can get it. A couple more hits. Boom. There we go. Supply cap. Let's see what L does to respond. She has all these links. Another Overlord. Potentially. And just another Overlord coming pumped out. So really, not that big of a deal. Same play going on by L trying to get down CZ's Overlord, and CZ will just chuckle and laugh because it's really not that big of a deal. Uh, a couple of lings being sent in there by L, and the Overlord successfully uh, evaded the Queen's prompt and promiscuous onslaught. Um, this Overlord here just kind of chilling right outside the range of that. Uh, couple of lings, probably going down to capture that. Um, nothing really being built, nothing out of control. 
We do have the spawning pool with the upgraded uh, speed. Uh, what's going on over here? What's going on? Um, sp spawning pool did just researching speed there. Elle a little bit behind, but she does have that roach worm going down. Uh, Seeds does not seem to be building um, any of that. He will be building a bunch of links. Got those, uh, got those extractors going up. Um, 21 drones to seeds, 34 drones. Probably going to be looking at a third expansion base here soon. Um, these mineral supply, actually they look pretty. Um, an evolution chamber and uh, dual evo chambers going up by seeds there in main base. Um, definitely going to be using that for uh, upgrades, yeah. Just usually just mainly just uh, melee unit upgrades. So what's the uh, what's the strat in getting two of those? What? What's the strat in the in a player building two Evo chambers? More upgrades. It's, oh. a, weird, it's a weird play. So we have these lings coming down here. We have these lings coming down here. Will they be able to get a little bit of uh, damage done to this queen? We'll see if the if yeah. these lings. Uh, L sending her lings down. Got a little bit of micro battle going down. Seeds will retreat. Um. Nothing too insane. Do you have... Yeah, the queen went down? Oh, it did. Indeed, it did go down. And uh, it looks like two queens being dropped there by Seeds. One queen by Al. We're going to take a sip of coffee here one sec. Seeds, on the other hand, also did take uh, over that uh, control point there in the middle. Seeds with that third base we were talking about earlier. Sitting at 500, uh, 500 minerals, 600 gas. Let's check out the army. L spending uh, 1k mineral so far on her army. And what does she have to show for it? She has a bunch of links. Probably would be a good idea to grab some of those roaches. Uh, you did build the roach, Warren. However, are no. not... Uh, what? Will get surrounded by the link. But if her links can go and surround his links, and then the roaches will provide that extra range damage that both players are so desperately looking for. The infestation pit. And um, CZ is definitely teching up, building... a. Uh, Upgrades like crazy. Has the upgrades. Uh, the layer is researching. Um, what? New building. Awkward, let's say oh, this one? The infestation pit. Yeah. yeah. Um, Seeds uh, expanding the creep. Both teams expanding the creep. We did see last game. Oh, Jiminy's. We got those spine crawlers going up. It looks like uh, L is building mainly defense um, in anticipation of this huge swarm. Uh, brace yourselves, winter is coming. Um, yeah, so cg has got those three bases. Um, L's only down to two. And uh, lots of supply, er, lots of supply from both teams. Supply cap's not going to be an issue anymore. Seed's just building this army here in, in mid. Well, he has a huge, uh, he has a huge mineral lead right now. And he also has a pretty huge gas lead, yeah, as well. Uh, but L has a larger, uh, army time being, but seeds will quickly, quickly overcome that. Yeah, because you can see in production, um, L's kind of not doing a whole, whole lot uh, in terms of pumping out units. Um, what would counter a bunch of uh, links? Um, what kind of zerg unit could you could use to counter that? I don't know. That's a white um, So we do see those roaches there. Hopefully like that'll be able to provide, things. hopefully that'll provide a little bit of range that L might need in the upcoming I battle. Um... Hive upgrade, indeed. Upgraded to the layer. Uh, this one... No, it's a, it's yeah? Upgraded from a layer. Oh, from a layer? It's going into a hive. Oh, very well. Hive it is. Let's see, and uh, both teams upgrading. Upgrading the main base. Um, oh, it looks like Cal is just upgrading to a layer now. Yeah. yeah, L's just upgraded to a layer. Uh, has so, third rank. Oh, here we go, finally. A little bit something interesting. Seed's going into micro with those links. Showing him, showing uh, L and what what they just burrow. Yeah, they, yeah, he was just checking out. Uh, they, they, see, just, see they just they just they just literally burrowed. Mm -hmm. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, it does seem kind of obvious. It looks like the links have gotten the ability to burrow through solid concrete. So uh, spending any of their money either. That's pretty. That's pretty interesting. The links' ability to burrow down through concrete is probably going to be one of the turning points of this uh, this match. You know, they have this fantastic patch of dirt that they could dig in, or this fantastic patch of dirt, but with that research of, I think it's Iron Claw or Admantium Claw. The Admantium Claw that the Zergs employ definitely allow them to dig down through that. Uh, however, let's go see what is actually happening, slash what is actually real. Um, but what is real? That's a discussion for another day. Um, 
CZ just bumping down lanes like it's his day job. Uh, we have a couple of Evo chambers. Hydraless Den, very nice. It's nice to see. Um, got an Ultraless Cavern, so it looks like both teams are definitely going with different strats. Let's see how this works out. I know CZ definitely has the advantage when it comes to knowing what the other player is building. A hatchery, dual hatchery is going down by CZ. Oh, this is, this is just dominating control. because he has complete vision. He has hatcheries at pretty much every location possible. Second one just going up right there. Wonder if he's going to put one down here and use it because he has this one choke point because uh, L can only leave the base from this point. And uh, actually, yeah, that is all. She is completely blocked off, and uh, unless there, unless we're going to be seeing some kind of Nautilus, uh, Nautilus cavern, cavern, Nidus cavern, Nidus cavern, Nidus canal, like the vaginal, like the vaginal <laughs> canal, but formed with Nidus. Um, yeah, so definitely, it looks like a complete a GG from this point by Seedzy. You never know though. Zerg is uh, Zerg is that race that's always up in the air. Um, because we got those hydralists, right? We're pumping out the hydralists, and we're pumping out. Um... It is something he's not aware of. Yeah, he uh, CT has no idea that those hydras are there. And um... does CT? Oh no, that's L. I was like, CT has complete view of his base. What? That's crazy. Um... Yeah, so we're gonna burrow those right there by the uh, by the hatchery, protecting that. Even though there really is, that's just a massive army. One, two, three. Get him off. Just full of full of links. It's a beautiful sight to see. Um, Mineral field depleted. Mineral field is complete. Mineral field uh, depleted. Looks like we're going to be setting in finally. Uh, CZ going in, taking out those. Uh, taking out those. The hydralists definitely doing their job. The hydralists are being currently. Um, they're currently being like protected by those. Uh, by those roaches and definitely putting the hydralis in the middle. Oh, but those lings. CT, uh, CT did his upgrades. CT definitely teched up, and that was I thought those I thought those hydralis were gonna be able to pull that off. And uh, even with those, oh wow, with the ultralis there, and we oh, have this yeah. huge this huge army of ultralis. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is just I don't even know what that is. That just that looks dangerous. Ultra. This yeah, looks dangerous. Sense. This needs to get out of there. Ladies and gentlemen, this is quickly becoming something that you and your family did not want to be a part of. Hide your kids, hide your wives, because these ultralists are snatching everybody up in here. And I honestly have no idea what's going to happen. I you do. Is, those in here. Okay. is the uh, is the max pop? You can have yeah, two hundred, right? Yeah. So CZ definitely like max that. popped. Uh, just waiting. Took just out the, took out the entire army. He's just waiting on the world to over. change. I perhaps that was CZ's main uh, main purpose is he was sending these in just for the just to scout and to try and get free up some space. Oh, we got some reinforcements there. So we have a bunch of roaches. Roaches. We have a bunch of hydras. Now, what would be a good idea? Can these attack you air? Yeah. yeah, these yeah, can't attack air, can they? Uh, now I wonder if uh, I wonder if L has seen these. Uh, no, she has not. With the brutal, brutal, brutal um, map awareness, no L has no idea that these uh, that these ultras are waiting just minutes from her base. Um, this is going to be a huge stomp fest in the next coming moments. L is probably baited into believing that Seeds is still massing uh, just those zerglings. It's in 19 minutes so far, ladies and gentlemen. This is going very long. Oh, and we're loading up the overlords. We're getting ready to move in for the kill. This is an exciting moment in gaming history. Mineral Another field mineral field yeah, being could, depleted by CZ. However, yeah. If the uh, loading up the rest of them. Mineral field I don't know what depleted. He's doing if Having these bad control. It, the overlords have about 200 mm -hmm. HP each. Now, if the those, overlords... Those hydras can drop those overlords. Oh, we're going to have to... Let's go view all right here. Um, let's see. What's the hydra's damage? Um, hydras are down here. He have hydras. They do yeah, have... They have the spore crawlers, though, which... Oh, game. done. That's done. That's GG, ladies and gentlemen. That has to be. It's going to be a wow somewhere here. There's uh, ultralisks everywhere just stomping. And uh, will this Ultralisk go down? Yes, they do get one. They do get two. However, L is just completely swarmed out of her mind. Um, yeah. Definitely an entertaining game to watch. So many minerals just needlessly um, <laughs> racked up. 
with absolutely no purpose. And L just w waiting to do absolutely nothing. Um, we're gonna see the GG come up here shortly. And uh, I think there's more so shock right now. So <laughs> at least pizza has just been dropped in my base. And uh, that's the GG, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for coming to check out game two. We will be going into game three here uh, very shortly. Uh, stay tuned. Thanks for coming out. Make sure you comment, rate, and subscribe for the latest. And uh, Mostly legal. let us know who you're cheering for. Let us know if you're cheering for CZ, if you're cheering for the comeback kid L. We will be checking out game three. Cheer for me. Stay tuned. Cheer for me. Cheer for me. Cheer for me.